The search for genetic material. Genes are the locus on the chromosomes that code the character of an organism. Chromosomes are referred to as the vehicles of genes as per the chromosomal theory of Sutton and Bovary. During gametogenesis, the chromosomes get segregated due to meiosis. The gametes hence produced are called haploid. They form a zygote of diploid nature due to random fertilization. Transforming principle Griffith F. conducted an experiment discovering the transformation principle. He worked on diplococcus pneumoniae of R and S types. R is a rough, non-capsulated and non-virulent form when injected into mice. It causes no death. S is a smooth, capsulated and virulent form. It, when injected into mice, causes death. On injecting heat-killed S strain, mice were alive. On injecting a mixture of heat-killed S strain and fresh R strain, mice died. This experiment confirmed that R strain, the non-virulent strain, was transformed into S strain, the virulent strain, due to heat-killed strain. Biochemical characterization of transforming principle. O.T. Avery, McLeod and McCarty identified the transforming principle in 1944. In their experiment, S-strain extract was treated with various enzymes like protease, amylase, lipase, RNAs, and DNAs and conducted transformation assays. S-filtrate was treated with DNAs for the transformation of R-strain to S strain, but the transformation did not take place. S filtrate was then treated with other enzymes for the transformation of R to S strain, which occurred. Hence, they came to the conclusion that DNA was the genetic material. Properties of genetic material DNA versus RNA. Genetic material is an essential part of living organisms that transfers characters from parents to offspring. Molecules are called genetic material if they have the following characteristics. It should be able to replicate. It should be chemically and structurally stable. It should be able to undergo mutation slowly. It should be able to express itself in the form of Mendelian characters. Both DNA and RNA are capable of producing their duplicates. It is clear from Griffith's transforming principle that even if heated, DNA retains certain properties and that it has the ability to reconstruct itself under specific conditions. RNA is highly reactive and easily degradable. Therefore, DNA is a better genetic material. Both DNA and RNA undergo mutations, but RNA mutates at a faster rate as it is unstable. RNA directly codes for protein synthesis, while DNA depends on RNA for the same. Conclusion 
DNA is used to store genetic information. And RNA is used for gene expression by protein synthesis.